Say goodbye to pain. Hello my friends. The ultimate guide to using herbs for pain relief. Unveiling nature's soothing secrets, exploring the world of herbal painkillers. Here are some common ways to use painkiller herbs. When using painkiller herbs, there are several methods of administration depending on the herb and the type of pain you're experiencing. Herbal teas. Many pain relieving herbs can be brewed into teas. Simply steep the dried herb in hot water for about 5 to 10 minutes, then strain and drink. You can sweeten the tea with honey or add lemon for flavor if desired. Example, white willow bark, ginger, turmeric, chamomile. How to make willow bark tea Willow bark tea, often called nature's aspirin, has been used for centuries to relieve pain and inflammation. It contains solacin, which has pain-relieving and anti-inflammatory properties similar to aspirin. Here's how you can make it at home. Ingredients 4 teaspoons of white willow bark 2 cups of filtered water optional, 1 cinnamon stick optional, 2 teaspoons of honey. 2. Instructions Boil the water in a saucepan. Add the white willow bark to the boiling water. Let it simmer for 5 to 10 minutes. Turn off the heat and allow the willow bark to steep for an additional 20 to 30 minutes. Strain the tea into teacups. Optionally, add a cinnamon stick for extra flavor and sweeten with honey. 3. Benefits Natural Analgesic Willow bark tea is known for its pain relieving properties, especially for headaches. Reduces arthritic pain, some studies suggest it may help with chronic lower back pain, joint pain, and osteoarthritis. Antipyretic, fever reducing, properties, willow bark was historically used to reduce fever. How to make ginger tea Ginger tea is a delightful and soothing beverage that you can easily make at home. Here's a simple recipe for making ginger tea. Ingredients 1, 1 inch, piece of fresh ginger, at least 1 inch wide 1 and a half cups water honey, optional, for serving, lemon wedge, optional, for serving. Instructions Cut the fresh ginger root into 4 rounds, no need to peel. Place the ginger rounds in a small saucepan and add 1 and a half cups of water. Cover the saucepan and bring the water to a boil over medium-high heat. Once boiling, uncover the pot, reduce the heat to medium-low, and gently simmer the ginger and water mixture for 10 minutes. Carefully pour the tea through a fine mesh strainer into a mug. Alternatively, you can use a fork to remove the ginger slices and then pour the tea into a mug. If desired, sweeten your ginger tea with a spoonful of honey and add a squeeze of lemon to balance the spiciness of the ginger. Enjoy your homemade ginger tea. How to make turmeric tea Turmeric tea is a wonderful and soothing beverage that offers numerous health benefits. Here is a simple recipe for making turmeric tea. Ingredients 2 cups water 1 inch of fresh turmeric root, minced, or half teaspoon ground turmeric optional, 1 inch of fresh ginger, minced, or half teaspoon dried ginger optional, 1 to 2 cinnamon sticks or half teaspoon ground cinnamon optional, 10 black peppercorns. Optional, 1 teaspoon cayenne pepper optional, 2 herbal tea bags. Honey, to taste, small squeeze of lemon or orange juice, to taste, milk or alternative milk, optional, sugar alternative, optional. Instructions Choose your turmeric. 
ground turmeric is more widely available, but fresh turmeric root can be found at farmers markets or health food stores. To mince fresh turmeric, peel it with a small spoon and then grate it. Prepare optional ingredients. Grate fresh ginger similarly to turmeric. Cinnamon sticks can be added whole or ground using a mortar and pestle or coffee grinder. Add black pepper and cayenne pepper for extra flavor and metabolism boost. Brew the tea. Bring two cups of water to a boil in a small saucepan or kettle. Add the turmeric, and optional ingredients, directly to the boiling water. Reduce the heat to low and simmer for 10 minutes. Remove the saucepan from the heat. Strain and serve. Pour the tea through a fine mesh strainer into a mug. Sweeten with honey and add a squeeze of lemon or orange juice. Optionally, add milk or a milk alternative. Enjoy your homemade turmeric tea. It's not only delicious but also packed with antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties. How to make chamomile tea Here are the steps to make chamomile tea. Gather ingredients, chamomile tea bags or loose chamomile flowers boiling water optional, honey, lemon, or other flavorings boil water, bring water to a boil in a kettle or on the stove top. Prepare the tea bag or loose flowers, if using a tea bag, place it in a cup. If using loose chamomile flowers, use a tea infuser or strainer to hold the flowers. Pour hot water over the tea, pour the boiling water over the tea bag or loose flowers in the cup. Steep the tea, let the tea steep for about 5 minutes. Adjust the steeping time based on your preference for stronger or milder flavor. Remove the tea bag or strainer, take out the tea bag or remove the strainer with the chamomile flowers. Optional flavorings, add honey, lemon, or other flavorings to taste. Enjoy! Sip the warm chamomile tea and relax. Chamomile tea is known for its calming properties and is often enjoyed before bedtime. It's a soothing and fragrant herbal tea that can help promote relaxation and better sleep. Feel free to adjust the ingredients and steeping time to suit your taste preferences. Topical Applications Some herbs can be applied topically as creams, ointments, or oils to the affected area to provide localized pain relief. Example, Arnica, Capsicum, from Chili Peppers, Clove Oil. Topical Applications of Arnica how to make capsicum ointment. Add olive oil plus cayenne powder into a heat-proof glass jar. Place that glass jar into a saucepan that contains about an inch of water to create a double boiler. Stir the mixture in the glass jar while the water simmers for 15-20 minutes over medium heat. Remove the jar to cool for 30 minutes. How to make arnica ointment. 1 tablespoon beeswax pellets 1 tablespoon shea butter half cup arnica infused oil How to make clove ointment Fresh whole cloves Crush the cloves with a mortar and pestle Place your cloves in a small dark glass jar Cover the cloves with a carrier oil Seal the jar and shake it gently a couple of times Let the jar sit for about a 7 to 10 days Strain the cloves out of the oil Herbal tinctures Tinctures are concentrated herbal extracts made by soaking herbs in alcohol or a mixture of alcohol and water. They can be taken orally or applied topically. Example, valerian root, ginger, boswellia. How to make valerian root tinctures. Fill a jar three quarters full with a fresh root or dried root to make a tincture, you'd only need to fill it halfway full. Pour 50% alcohol to the top of the jar. Shake regularly and let sit for at least 4 to 6 weeks. At that point you can strain and bottle and take about a teaspoon before bed. Capsules or Tablets Some painkiller herbs are available in capsule or tablet form for easy oral consumption. Example, turmeric, white willow bark, ginger. How to make turmeric capsule 
with a spoon, mix the turmeric with black pepper in a glass dish with a flat bottom, open a capsule and using the larger segment, push the capsule down into the turmeric mixture, slide on the shorter segment until snug and secure. How to make willow bark capsules The powder willow bark and twigs in a coffee grinder and fill capsules. How to make ginger capsules at home Pour the ginger root powder into a bowl and drag the capsule halves toward one another so that they scoop up the powder. When the two halves of the capsule are filled with the ginger root powder, slide them together carefully so as not to spill the powder. Herbal Poultices Poultices are made by grinding fresh or dried herbs into a paste and applying them directly to the skin. They can be especially useful for treating bruises, sprains, or muscle pain. Example, Comfrey, Arnica. How to make a comfrey poultice. Take the comfrey flowers, leaves and stems and place them into a powered blender. Add water and add the lid. Blend until you're left with a rough puree. Add binder and blend again. How to make Arnica poultice. Take a handful of arnica flowers and mash or grate them well. Mix with just enough water to make a paste from your mashed flowers. Apply the paste directly to the bruise and cover with a piece of clean flannel cloth or a clean bandage. Herbal Baths Adding pain-relieving herbs to a warm bath can help relax muscles and ease pain. You can use dried herbs directly or infuse them in hot water using a cloth bag or muslin pouch. Example, Epsom salt, not an herb, but commonly used in herbal baths, chamomile, lavender. Herbal Combinations Combining multiple pain-relieving herbs can enhance their effects and provide more comprehensive relief. You can create custom herbal blends tailored to your specific needs. Example, Turmeric Ginger Blend Chamomile Lavender Blend Thank you for watching if you like this video please subscribe our channel.